In this video, we'll see how easy it is to view a simple data file on a mobile phone. We're using Catavolt Extender, a cloud service that gives you secure access to your enterprise data from mobile devices. We'll start with a simple database table. Our table is the list of account names and addresses along with some AR information. This dashboard is in the cloud. As you can see, we don't have any data objects, so we'll create one. We start by clicking the New button. Extender shows us a list of the database tables. Let's select Customer underscore Account. We have to give our data object a name, so we'll call this one Accounts. In the Accounts object, we need to define a query of the data. We'll call this one General. Then we'll click the checkbox to be sure we can see it on a mobile device. Now it's time to say what properties will be included in the general query. We'll start with the account name and the open amount. We can click a button to add those two properties to our list. Let's make the name show first. Now we'll add the address information, street address, city, state, and postal code. You can select the properties one by one or as a group. It just takes a few more clicks to add the AR information. The database names are not what we want the users to see. For example, instead of account underscore name, we want just the word name with a capital N. We'll go down the list and fix them all up so they look right to the user. This completes the properties in the view. To make the account show alphabetically, we will delete the default sort. Let's replace it with one that orders the list by name in ascending sequence. This completes the general query. The next step is to add our object to a menu. In Catavolt Extender, a menu is called a workbench. We'll create a new workbench called Mobile. Now we'll add our new Accounts object to it. The last step is to identify which users get to use this workbench. We're going to let the user called Sales use the new workbench. Our new accounts object is ready. Let's see how it looks. Here you see a mobile device. The user is going to sign on with the profile called Sales. You can see that the accounts object appears right away. He can easily see all the information we chose to show, name, number, address, and AR data. It's easy to search for an account. He touches Menu and then Search. Now he's going to look through all the accounts by searching for A, I, R. He puts that in and the host system finds three accounts. The first two with air in their name and the third one with air in the address. We can set the search to include all the properties if it makes it easier for the users to find what they're looking for. Sometimes users want to see more than we thought. Let's say that the sales rep needs to see credit limit. We can add it in a few seconds. It just takes a couple of clicks to add the property. We fix the description. And credit limit is now added. Back on the mobile device, the user simply backs up and then requests accounts again. Two touches. Credit limit is there and the user didn't even sign off. This also works for other mobile devices like Apple, Blackberry, and Windows. Here's an Apple device. 
If we sign on as the same user, we'll see the same thing. Here is the list of accounts, and you can see that it includes credit limit. This is just the beginning of what Catavolt Extender can do. If you want to see more, send us an email and we'll arrange for a more thorough demonstration.